Hello! This week we are in Dieppe, New Brunswick for the last Canada Cup of the season. Yep, last Canada Cup. Whee! Yeah. Oh, this is weird. You either go step up, drop, or just go around the step up. So there is not that much climbing on this course. It's mostly flat with a few little kickers, but that's what makes it really hard because there's absolutely no recovery. This was yesterday's short track. Now we're going backwards on it. Don't make it. <gasps> oh yeah! Third it. Not meant to be done that way. All right, single track time. The trails here are super twisty and rooty, so it's really hard to follow anyone closely. You're just always surprised by a tree or a big root or something. So that's part of strategy here for sure. Whew, that bar was close. A little bit of a drop. You feel like you want to go right here. Oh, it works. Yeah, Vince is crushing it. Super fast descent. Trying to avoid a few breaking bumps here and there. This one. The root gap. Wow. Alright, those little descents are fun. So, as I was saying, the descent, it's mostly flat. So the descents are short, and the climbs are short, but they're like back to back. So the descents being short give you like a 15 second break, and then you're back pushing. And there's really like no easy climbs because with all the roots, you always have to keep like good tension on the chain to keep traction and all that stuff. Okay. Kind of dying. Whee! Little back wheel drift. We had a lot of rain in the past few days here. So the course is surprisingly dry other than like a few spots but it just keeps, keeps you on your toes the whole way around. Nice little climb coming up. Ooh, slide city. So this inside there, hug the outside. Watch out for the little tree stumps. I like the outside. And then the rocks are slippery. Okay, that was probably the worst I did it. I've done it today. So. Hey. Ooh, this is fun. A little gap jump. A few foul strokes. Whee! Another one, pretty short. <coughs> Corner drop. And we're back climbing. So that's all the recovery you get. But it's fun recovery. And we turn right into what I think is the hardest physical part of the course. It's just steady climb but the roots are everywhere and if you lose momentum or like slide in the corner it's super hard to pick pick up the speed again okay 
Okay, going outside there. Grab a little more speed. And then, a little sw tight switch back. Oh, got stung by a bee or a wasp or something like that. Fun. Out. Ouchie. No fun. So going into it, I'd say, is the most technical part of the course. Careful, those logs are really slippery. And then just kind of a roll, little jump to a right-hander. And we climb, but this one, slippery Rudy, just gotta kick it pretty hard. Then go straight into another root climb, a uh, root descent. That just keeps on going up and then back down. That tight right hander there. This one, Whew. you gotta be, just pay attention because there's like little jumps, gaps over roots that you want to do to keep the momentum. Okay, that corner is hard. It's tight and slippery. So this would be your last passing opportunity on the left. You turn right into the wood there, and then there's one more single track. And the sprint, which is longer this year, so you might be able to pass, but I'd say it's unlikely that you'll pass in a sprint. So this was really your last passing. Just some twisty single track. It's fun if you just put a little bit of a new pack. You can see where people are, if people are suffering or not. And then you pop out here. Last little tech section for the course. Lots of line. I've never done this one before, so there you go. First time. Right hander would send this year because I crashed last year. And just full full sprint to the finish which is under the arch. <laughs> so, yeah, fun course. Great technical section and really hard, even if it's not that climbing. Cool, race tomorrow.